So there are ways to select uh, objects inside of Paint 3D. For example, if I want to uh, select a shape, for example, if I have this shape right here, you can see that I can move it around and it sticks on the background over here in the canvas. So if I want to select it out, I can use the selection tool right here, simply click and drag. And now what I can do is I can move this object around. Let me just use a fill tool over here. Let's say for example, I'm gonna go into my brushes and I'm gonna fill the canvas up just like this. If you want to move the object, I can use the selection tool right here. I can select it out and then move it out just like this. But what happens is that it actually cuts off the edges as you can see right here. And what if I want to actually select some round object like these? So let's say I have this object and if I were to use my selection tool right here and then move it, you can see that I actually have the background moving with me. So in that case, what I want the uh, Paint 3D to do is understand where the edges lie in an object and then move only that particular object. In that case, I can use magic select right here and I'm going to say that select only this area. So I'm going to drag this over here because I'm using the magic select right here and I want to select only this area right here and I'm going to press next over here and you can see that it actually detects the edge over here and you have an option to automatically fill the background it actually detected the edge now I'm going to press ok and what it does is that it actually now selects just the area and this is a 3d object at the moment so if i were to go to 3d object you can see that now this has been placed as a 3d object i can go back over here and press make sticker to actually stick it back over here in the canvas so i can do that with the objects as well so let's see for example i got this sticker right here so over here right now this is in the canvas so if i want to select it i can go to magic select i'm going to crop it out into this section right here press next and over here it selects just this lips right here I can auto fill the background so it will analyze the background over here and then fill it otherwise I can disable it as well and let's see the result and I'm going to press ok so once you do that you can see that only that part has been cut off and that has been changed into a sticker over here just like that so I want to stick it back I can simply go back and click make sticker so that is how you can use selection and magic select tool inside of paint 3d hope you guys learned something as always and as always please like comment share and subscribe